Super Bowl. It's bigger than the Masters. It's bigger than the World Series. It's bigger than the NCAA championship that Auburn's going to win this March. Hold up. Wait a minute. It's called the Bassmaster Classic. And uh, basically, it's the most important event of the year. I mean, it's like the Olympics, but bigger. And uh, it's in Tulsa, Oklahoma. It's going down on Grand Lake. Unfortunately, we're not fishing it this year, but this will be the only year that we're not fishing the Classic. Um, but it's my, my last year working the Expo, so it'll be a lot of fun working for Bass Pro, the little Mercury casting competition, going to speak to the youth anglers. And tomorrow, we're fishing the Celebrity Pro-Am Tournament before the Classic starts. The Classic's Friday, Saturday, Sunday, so we're getting there the day early on Wednesday. And this is Pro-Am Thursday, and uh, it's gonna be awesome. Strange color. What is this big, big, big mics? Our Alabama boys take everything seriously. Don't you? <laughs> we do. I'll make sure before y'all take off, my cook's not in your boat. <laughs> okay. All right. Can do that. Yeah. We'll give you a shout out on the YouTube channel. Oh, well, thank you. Yes, sir. Big mics. Come get it. Ooh. See, I'm finished up. Logan's got a little bit left. You didn't eat your fries. I did. All of them? All of them. Damn, bro. Gone. I know it. You were sucking them things down. I was. Where are we? I don't know what town we're in. I don't know. Hang on. If you're in... If you're driving through Forest City, Arkansas, stop here. Mike's Paradise Barbecue and Grill. Very good. Lovely Russellville, Arkansas, home of notorious Lake Dardanelle. That's the site of the Collegiate Bass Open. Every September, October ish time frame, once a year, we get to come to lovely Lake Dardanelle and catch four fish a day, three fish a day. I've like top 20 to every tournament we've had out here, so grass and pad. Do a little swim jig action and uh, not so much live scope action, more <laughs> more straight braid action. More eye scoping. Bro, an 80 mile an hour speed limit. Are you f***ing serious? Holy Gotta blow this horse back off. We got 80 mile per hour roads and left them. exits. Uh, this is I, crazy. I like What's oh, going yeah. on here? Dude, every time I cough, my abs are like, oh! <laughs> we gotta get that six back so we can keep picking up them eight pounders. You know, when we lean over on the side of the boat, it's really stresses on the core. I gotta be. Oh. These are cool. Logan's filling up the boat, but then you go down to this gas pump, and he's also filling up the truck. Hey, why don't you save some gas for the rest of us, dude? That's just a couple hundred dollars job right here. Crazy. It's part of it, man. Pop gas, catch a few bass, repeat. Repeat. <laughs> time to go 85 till we get there. We'll be there in no time, dude. Be there in no time at all. Oh my gosh, it's Bass Pro Shops! We finally made it! 12 and a half hours later! I didn't know who that was. I thought someone was honking at you.
I didn't know that you could fish the Bass Pro Shop spawn. We might have to go over there and <laughs> might have to test the test the waters out. Get a line wet. Uh oh. We're rigging up every spinning reel I have because tomorrow it's showtime for the first ever. I don't know, maybe not first ever, but the progressive Bassmaster Pro Am. There's ten teams, eight Elite Series guys, eight celebrities, and a couple other you know athletes that they have their own teams there's 10 teams we're going out tomorrow we're fishing for a brand new boat apparently they haven't told us the prizes yet but that's what the word on the street is and uh i'm fishing with ross chastain he's uh, been blowing it up on the nascar circuit it was, it was a once in a lifetime a once in a generation type move move where a freaking 180 around the track hugging the wall it was crazy he probably could have killed himself just about but he didn't and uh, it seems like a lot of fun. He drives a Bushlight NASCAR car with a freaking bass on the side of it. So you know he knows how to fish. He said he likes spinning rods, so we're rigging up 12 of them. And we're going to go spin piece them tomorrow and hopefully get the dub. Sitting out here in the parking lot of the Bass Pro Shops at Broken Arrow. Going to have to go in there and see what they got for sale here shortly. If you see this, please don't rob me. Um, but they're you know kind enough to let me keep the boat in the locked storage facility and uh, for the weekend so My hands cramp. Got to wrap that FG tight like a Chinese finger trap. Did you ever get one of those? Oh yeah, dude. I need a rod sock sponsor. That'd be nice. <laughs> I really don't know if we'll be making any cast with this guy. Probably. Unlikely. Rather unlikely. Damn, son. That was gnarly. It's nice we got a little light there for us. Oh, yeah, we're good. So this will be open in the morning? Yeah, I'm going to be here about 4.30. Okay. Um, let everybody out. Everybody should be out of the way. I got to move a couple. We got some boats that are going to the event for the show. Ah. Uh, and we uh, accidentally put them in front of a couple of your other pro buddies' boats. So. Gotcha. Should just leave it. That way we don't have to compete against them tomorrow. We got here at like 6.30. I've been sitting out there taking off all my Lake Fork baits. <laughs> we are headed to the Bass Pro Shops to get the nitro and then to the lake to get the trophy. About 6.30, got here about 6.30 p.m. So that's the goal today. Are all of the watermelons like hidden in the lava? Yeah, the boat's actually only going to run about 30 because we have so many watermelons in all of the compartments. So we can smash them after we get the wind. Right? Tell them we're telling about that. Oh, I'm the cow out of the bag. That's what attracts the bass, guys. <laughs> they can smell it. We're going to squeeze the watermelon juice out on the water, and they're going to just swim to our boat. You're in trouble, Ross. Ross, do you have any thoughts on the Marvel Bassmaster? Uh, 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 Fear. 
fear? Fear. Uh, it's natural. Yeah. It's natural. Yeah. Okay. Not, I can't. At least I can't know about it. He won't know about it. Is there like a superstition? Yeah, we have it in the holler and they can't. Nobody touches it until like it. Help us catch fish if we could at least spend a few hours out here. <clears throat> but you kind of you throw it out there at the fish, and like we'll see it go down to the fish on the screen. And right when it gets just above the fish, you tighten your line and you just quiver it like this, and you kind of just pick the line up, and uh, the fish will start to come up after it. And hopefully, we'll uh, catch them. All right. Are those spots fish? They're fish of some sort, but I'm, they're not bass. Because they're small, is that how you can tell? They're just just looking at this shit like every day. You What's just, that big one right there? Just like a bunch of trash fish, probably white bass. Kind of br bring them out of there. Yeah, that's perfect. All right, try again. Try throwing a little bit to the left of the tree. That's perfect. Let it sink. Keep letting it sink. Yeah, he's on it. Reel it up a little bit. They're coming to it. Oh, eat it, eat it. Did he eat it? Yep, reel him. I gotta get the net. Please be a bass. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Heck yeah, that's a 12 incher, baby. <laughs> All right. So we got to be very specific about this shit. So, of course, he's not going to cooperate. Mouth has to be closed. Does it need to be? Mouth has to be closed. Fingers can be right there. Go ahead and take that if you can. Do you want to take it sideways? Or? I fished a tournament like this before and I got penalized. It was so stupid. It's got to be tight. Yeah, it's we're going to have to go 15 and uh, 3 eighths. No, it's all quarters. Yeah, 15 just and do quarter. 15 and a quarter. Yep. <clears throat> did you get a good picture of no. it? No. I took 20 <laughs> Oh, did you? Oh, on that? Yeah. No, of me? Oh, no. Yeah, you hold it up. Good, now do it. Perfect. Awesome. Okay. So right. you got you got a good picture for sure of it. Hold on. Let, let's let's it. make sure we no do this right. Yeah. Yeah. Not normally like Take that. Take photo. Me. God. Don't yeah. submit that one. <laughs> oh, we're gonna rail them if they're on these trees. That was the first tree we fished. We got number one, baby. <laughs> I think it's a white bass. Yeah, white bass. Big bass is just oh, 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 like just head shaking down there. I don't know what the word would be. Come on. I don't think he's gonna. He might be twelve. Hell, we'll try him. Come on, baby. Please. Oh yeah, let's go, number two. Akina three quarter? Our first two tournaments were in basically both in Texas and this is all we did. And we caught pretty big ones, so. Freaking white bass. It's a striper. It's a striper. God, it got me fired up, dude. That's cool. He choked it too. Yes, 
saying. Oh my, I was how like, the hell? God. What the hell is I, I thought I tried that to get y'all going, and it didn't work either. I, I tried to... The make your egg. Dude, he is short. Look how he's got, like a, he's got, an he's got a messed up tail. That might cost us. I think he's gonna be twelve. Now. I think he's twelve. I was trying to get him while you were talking, but I kept missing him, making bad casts. <laughs> I was fishing, fishing hard for him. Oh yeah, baby. Hey. He's got that, that bottom tip. He's got like a messed up. I like, close that mouth, boy. Not that much comfortable. Here. You. That should work. What was he? 14. He didn't, did he hit 14? Yeah. How was it out there today, guys? It's good. It's good. It's fun. You yeah. got on in early. Yeah. Yeah, it was good. Yeah. Heck yeah, man. Yeah, we had that. Yeah, one right off the bat, and then and I struck out the rest of the day. At least you caught the first one, and it was quick, right? Yes. Yeah, he got real excited. <laughs> oh, I'm sure. We had it in the boat, and he was like, "I get to fish now." <laughs> right. Exactly. Well, we did win the striper tournament. Yeah, y'all did. We won that. So, that was that, that was actually that, two boats, right? Trip. For for the striper tournament. <laughs> Warm. <laughs> yeah. No, no, not too bad. Yeah. It's like a frat house temperature guy. Yeah. Hey guys, Logan Parks here with Ross Chastain. We just finished up the Bassmaster Celebrity Pro Am at the Classic on Lake Skytook, and uh, we had an awesome day. Caught three fish. We needed our fourth one, but it's a lot of fun getting to fish with a legendary NASCAR driver. Super cool opportunity. The only thing harder is to catch that fourth fish is pronouncing the name of the lake. So, Sky <laughs> Toast. Sky Toast. Got it down by the end of the day. Uh, yeah, a lot of fun, man. Thank you, Lake, for coaching me. Thanks for showing me the ropes. He told me at one point, I, I'm not going to tell you. I said, no, please tell me what to do. And uh, I'm a better fisherman than I'm worth. Hey, he caught the biggest fish of the day, so uh, we're happy to have it, but enjoy it, man. I get a fish with you. Probably the number one ranked over the last six or seven years fishing team. How many have been on the team? A hundred? Yeah, close to a hundred. Oh, okay. A lot of guys on the team. Really? Guys and girls. Yeah. yeah. So what are talking about? That? Is it NCAA sanctioned or? No. No, so you guys can. Honestly, the NIL thing was like the worst thing that could happen to us. Yeah. How big were your other three? Uh, 53 or something. We're going to the Bassmaster Classic Expo. We're gonna go work the Bass Pro Shops booth and then the Mercury booth. It's about a quarter of a mile away. 
our steps in for the day and watch everyone else on live. Fishing, man. Hadn't updated them either. <laughs> Didn't you say it was gonna take 30 minutes a piece? Yeah, I hadn't done it yet. Okay, so you have to pair your phone to the motor too? How do you do that? Really? It's way faster to put it on a chip. Okay. Cool. Toledo Bend was insane. Like that crowd, the third day, I've never seen anything like that. Like it's, I felt like there was 100,000 people out there, it was so crowded. When I'm on the stage, it's just blurry. Like I don't, but if I'm like on a podium and everyone's quiet, I'm like, start stumbling over my words and my lips start sticking to my teeth. I was so terrible, so nervous. <laughs> It's minutes. coming up soon. Anyway, they look good. Yeah. They look real good. They just didn't get to play anybody in that championship, so that makes me nervous. But yeah. Man, they I don't look know. good in the Florida's, game they did play. Florida's pretty solid. Yeah. Bruce Pearl said we're not losing another <laughs> game, so we'll see. I love Bruce. Dude, he's the I man. I can play for him. Yeah. No doubt, I can play for him. He's the man. <laughs> it is 3.30? I lied. It's at 3. So what are you doing in there? 3.15 is what my, <laughs> mine says. We're, we're ready for our Auburn Tigers. All the time. <laughs> Not all the time. We're going to get that W. Split the difference. Yeah. yeah, so we just wrapped up our first little requirement of the day. Unfortunately, our camera guy was, uh, he was down and out for the count. He was, he was yakking, but not yak packing. He was just straight yakking. We can't have that, you know, can't have it. not in front of the fans. No. <laughs> and Don't so we, we just went to Bass Pro and uh, I felt kind of out of place because I was probably 20 years younger than everyone else there signing autographs, maybe 30 years younger, honestly. Um, and everyone was, I was kind of in between some guys. So it was like the older people would come up with their hats and they would give them to the guy beside me, Terry Scroggins, then they'd get it back and skip me and give it to the next guy. Ah. So I was kind of like, all right guys, like that's just a little disrespectful. Yeah, what are we doing here? <laughs> like the disrespect was was there for sure, but I get it, you know. You don't know me, don't want my signature. But we did sign a bunch of autographs. How are y'all? Y'all got some good food? Heard that. I have to get some of this. What's the what's the best thing? The loaded potato. Hey, the loaded potato. The loaded potato. Yeah. What all comes on that? You can build it how you want to. Need the meat option right here. And you go with uh, cheese, onion, bread, sub, bread, barbecue sauce. And whatever you don't want, you don't have to do it. I'll do the brisket with no onions and no sour cream. No onions, no sour cream. Yeah. And what barbecue sauce would you like? I'll do hot. Hot. Right. Wait, what's 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 Alphabama? Okay, so we added it, but it's, oh. like, it's like an Alabama white sauce. But okay. Alright, All right, thank you. Alright, here you go, man. You keep doing what you're doing, man. I appreciate it, it, dude. Thank you. Alright. That's what's up. That's serious. There you go. Uh, nah, man. You sure? Yeah, I'm I appreciate it, man. Thank you. Uh, get your Thank you. I really appreciate that. There you go. Hey, don't lose yeah. that wallet. I lose my wallet all the time. All right, let me get a picture. All right. All right, gentlemen. Three, two. Uh -huh. All right, man. I appreciate you, dude. Bro, UAB might win. I ate a lot of food.
It's called the main gallery on the map. Bask oh, there's Baskat. Okay. I think, uh, yeah, come back out here into the hallway. You're on the, okay. I see the Baskat flag. I went fishing with him one day and he just straight up whipped my butt. <laughs> In the flash. <laughs> of course. Got a good name. There you go. Yeah, no problem. He just dipped out. I was like, oh. <laughs> you want me to sign that hat? He was like, yeet. <laughs> we got done with the cocks for the day. And uh, yeah, no more cocks for the day. Uh, you suck. 10 point lead ain't doing it for Logan. Nine points now. I mean, we're playing Yale. Like, we should beat their socks off. We beat all these other SEC teams by 30 points. I mean, come on. It's the, this is when you make a statement, you know? We need UConn to be very afraid of us when we make it to the Sweet 16. The Buck and Bass Hacienda. Um, we're about to go get acquainted with our personal suite. Oh, sweet. <laughs> He's like the, like the quintessential, like the uh, Buck and Bass um, model, if you will. Yeah, like <laughs> the human model. Four and five, let everyone had already left the way. Okay. So we just hung out. And then the... What you got planned for it? What's on the schedule? The plan is we're gonna go hang on. It's early here in Tulsa. The plan is to find energy somewhere in the form of a Celsius. And then we're gonna go work the actually first we have to speak with our good buddy Tucker Smith. Will be be pretty cool. I think that uh, it's the Go Army Outdoors Youth Forum or something, and so me and Tucker, I believe, are going to kick it off this morning at ten thirty. Okay. Sounds good, man. I is Tucker it. coming too? Yes, okay, he is. Good. Okay. Anyway, we have two microphones. Um, hope to get started. I've got you scheduled for ten thirty. Okay. So, um, I guess that's it. Hang out yeah. in here. Yeah. Hmm. What, what if no one shows? Got one. Hey man, what up? What's up? Good to see you. Yeah, dude. Yeah, good to see you. Hey, you too, buddy. What are y'all talking about? <laughs> just whatever. We're just gonna kind of tell yeah. our stories and, and nope. yeah. stuff. I'll intro you then. Um, I would say the biggest resource that I've found in really all of bass fishing at this time of age is really YouTube. Um, YouTube, if y'all aren't paying attention to it, y'all definitely need to pay attention to YouTube. Watch a bunch of YouTube fishing videos. There's a lot of different guys that talk about a bunch of different good stuff um, on YouTube, all about fishing, you know, how to, how to read electronics, how to fish a shell bar, how to fish shallow boat docks. You know, there's a lot of different stuff you could you can learn off YouTube. Um, What's up, dude? What's up? Having a good time? Good. Yeah, absolutely. I watched all four. 
that we launch Granny Core out of Natchitoches, yeah. and we'll launch the high school teams out of there. And I don't, I don't, I hate when the kids get out. Yeah, fun, but they weren't very big. <laughs> Some of the spots are actually starting to grow. Here you go. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, it was just like a pads deal. Dude, it was tough for a long time. It sucked. Which I found a big mat out. one time, caught a six out of it. It was pretty sick. Yeah. That still doesn't get. If you're patient, Brent will sign it. Is Michelle here? Yeah, but she did. She's like. Ben. Have y'all finished? Everybody. Dude, it's phenomenal. Y'all came in with killers. Yeah, everyone's. <laughs> yeah, what's the deal with that? I guess they're just like scared. Serious animosity. They're scared, dude. Yeah. That's what it is. You are not gonna be able. To All right, you're good. Expo has been good so far. Just uh, headed back to the Bass Pro booth. Just see that the Alpha food truck part two had a second loaded potato and it was awesome. <laughs> and now we're headed to the Bass Pro booth to uh, hang out for the next two hours.